Good afternoon, Big Spring High School. It's Thursday about five o'clock and we are about ready to call it a day here. Get ready for Easter weekend, three day weekend. Uh, stay safe, enjoy your family in this time of isolation. Next week, we're not gonna give you any work. We are going to call a time out, call it a bye week if you will. And this is just gonna be a time that our teachers can reach out to you and give you the support needed and the, the resources to catch up on your work to, to dig deeper a little bit in your learning, even redo your assignments if you want a better grade. So communicate with your teachers on how we can make the best of this uh, bye week, a week of, uh, uh, that we're not going to provide you with, with any assignments. Uh, we're gonna regroup, refresh, and, and reorganize and, and get ready to redistribute some work coming up in the following weeks. I'm about to read you uh, a statement that has been prepared. It's come to our attention that many of you are having uh, trouble getting onto your Google Classroom accounts, uh, uh, your email accounts, and so we wanna help you out with that. So I'm gonna read a statement for you here in just a moment, and then I'm gonna freeze it, and that way you can pause this YouTube announcement and get all the information that you need. Again, parents, if, if you need help, if you're not getting what you need, please check in with us. You can call us here at the high school, email us. You're doing a great job of, of getting in touch with you. I promise you, we're going to go straight to our teachers and get them in contact with your students because we want to work together through this because that's who we are. We're Steer Strong, Steer Nation, and we're going to rise up to the occasion. Go Steers! Okay, Big Spring High School, I'm about to read you the statement that's been prepared for you. And at the end of this, I'm going to lock in on the seven steps that you need so that you can pause this on YouTube and get the information that you need. At the beginning of this school year, you did not have access to your student email account. However, you do now. Here is what you need to know and do. You cannot access your student email through Gmail, and this is the sole way communication is transpired on Google Classrooms, which means if a teacher posts an assignment on Google Classroom, you're notified by your school email. If a teacher grades an assignment on Google Classroom, you're again notified through your school email. If a teacher has a question or comment and places it in an assignment, you're notified on your school email. So what I'm saying, it is vital that you have access to your school email and check it frequently. Okay, that's it. Have a great Easter weekend. We love you. Stay safe, stay strong, and continue to steer on.